Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. I have another fun video today and something I've never done before on my channel, and that is a sunglass collection video. So I have a slight small obsession with Key Australia sunglasses, and they're actually doing a BOGO sale, which is a buy one, get one free sale off their entire website. There are some exclusions, so I would check the website out, but I always take full advantage of these sales because I love these sunglasses and I'm going to show you my entire collection and try them on for you that way you can see each style um, and if you're watching this in the future and obviously like not around this time then this is just a great video for you guys to see what these sunglasses look like on so yeah I'm going to show you my entire Key Australia collection which is quite a lot. I have these little sunglass holders that I recently just bought on Amazon and if I can find them I'll link them down below for you but this is just one tray they have like it's like a little like bleachers for your sunglasses but this is one of them and then I actually have another one and this is the other one so I'm going to try every one of these pairs of sunglasses on for you and give you kind of my thoughts and I'll show you my favorite ones as well. So without further ado, let's get into it and everything is going to be listed in the description box below. Also before you leave, please don't forget to hit subscribe if you want to join the fam and give me that thumbs up button if you enjoyed this video. So yeah, let's get into it. Okay, so I'm going to start with like my aviators because that's generally the type that I go for when I don't know what else or what other kind of sunglasses I want to wear. I typically go for the aviator style. So my favorite is actually the High Key from Key Australia. This was like one of my original pairs. This is so beat up. The lenses are so scratched, but I adore these still. I really do need to get myself a new pair because the lenses just look atrocious at this point. Um, so always put your sunglasses in the cases that they come in so that this doesn't happen to you. But this is one of my original, like very first pairs. Again, this is the High Key. And this is in the collaboration with Desi. She's a YouTuber here. Um, but I love this. It's just a really classic gold style aviator it's not too big it is supposed to be like oversized but it's not like really oversized like way too big but it's also not too small either i would say i have a fairly medium size head i don't have a huge head but i also don't have a little head so i would say my head size is pretty pretty like on average and i do have like an elongated face like kind of like a heart shaped so if that helps you guys but i'm gonna try this pair on for you this, again, is like one of my absolute favorite pairs. I just think it's so flattering on. You can obviously wear them further down your nose if you want to get like your eyebrows in there. But I just love these. I love the gold. I think it's very, very pretty. So I have this pair. And then I also have them in the black frame with the gold lens. And it's really hard to see. That's a better... <laughs> kind of a better idea of what it is. The rim is black with a gold lens. This is actually one of my newest pairs and that is what it looks like on and just to give you guys like a side shot of it. Absolutely love these. Clearly I love them so much because I still have three more pairs. <laughs> this next one is again gold rimmed but it's a fade from brown to clear and again, I'll have these all listed down below in the order that I'm showing you. That way you know for sure which ones um, I'm showing. But this is also a really fun, cute pair. I love the fading of this one as well. Definitely, I tend to reach for these more on the days that I'm not wearing a ton of makeup just because they're kind of like, they're a little bit lighter of a sunglasses. Like it's not like a full on like, <laughs> like sun shielder. Um, kind of style so I tend to reach for these more on like my no makeup days too and then of course I had to get them in the black to clear fade as well because if I'm not wearing brown I'm wearing black so I needed that one as an option as well clearly <laughs> 
And then I also have the high key rimless style as well, so it doesn't have the frame. I actually had to order these on Amazon, so I'm not sure if they still have these available, but they do have other options for the high key rimless on their website, but this is what it looks like. It's actually a blue lens. That is what they look like on. I really love this style as well. I think the rimless looks so good. Um, and I just love like a mirrored lens. It's just one of my favorites. So, and then my last pair of like aviators that I have is actually probably my most worn pair. And I would say is looking at all these, probably my favorite too. This is the style Vivian. It's just like your classic black blacked out aviators i know it looks like it's not blacked out in the camera but they truly are um it's just i have a bright window behind me and it is very sunny today so and then i have a white comforter behind me <laughs> but when i put these on you'll see they're like completely blacked out i like the style of this just like a teeny bit more than the high keys that i just previously showed but i just think this is like the best like sporty just like grab your glasses and go you really don't have to think about it it goes with every outfit like I just I love these I feel like everybody needs a staple like good black aviator in their wardrobe so or in their collection so this is what they look like on like I was not kidding you when I told you they are like blacked out I love these they do block the sun really well as well and they do also come in a polarized version as well, which is an awesome option. Um, definitely pay attention to that on their website that they do offer that. So that is what these look like. I'll give you a little side shot. Love these. Definitely my most like sporty pair. Okay, next is kind of an aviator, but it's kind of not. This is the Jezebel, I believe. Yes, Jezebel. So it has the gold rim and then it has the kind of a black frame, but it's definitely not as black as like the Vivian is like in comparison. I would say they're probably more gray, but I don't honestly reach for these that often. They're just not a shape that I go for, but to give you guys an idea of what they look like, that's what they look like on. And I did forget to mention too that the high keys, the very first original pairs that I showed you, those do come in a mini version as well. So if you have a smaller face, that's a perfect option. But I have like just the normal standard size, <laughs> but they do offer minis. And I think in a lot of their sunglasses, they do offer a mini version as well, which is really nice. But yes, this is the Jezebel. And the next pair that I have is kind of a cross between an aviator and like a normal sunglass <laughs> or sunglasses and this is what they look like they kind of have like a little bit of a cat eye but like not really this is the style sweet dreams and this is a tortoise frame and then the lenses are more of like a dark brown i apologize too if you can see how dirty all of these are they are very much well loved and I get fingerprints on them all the time and I just didn't clean them before this video. I probably should have, but I do apologize about that. But this is also one of my like most reached for pairs because they're just so easy. They go with everything and I just love the tortoise shell. It's just so pretty. So that is what they look like on. Very flattering. I feel like a lot of people could wear this. And then this is the side view. Again, love these. And then this is the Sweet Dreams in just the black frame. So the same exact pair just in black because I always have to have my black option. I wear so much black in my wardrobe that it's just, it's a must. So I love these ones as well. I love all of them. So I'm going to sound really redundant, but I truly do. I just, all these sunglasses are just phenomenal. Okay, moving on to more of like my hater blocker style sunglasses. Like these are like large and in charge thick frames. So I'm either in like an aviator style mood or I'm in like a I don't want to show my face at all like mood. Um, so I do have like two separate moods when it comes to my sunglasses. But these are definitely like chunkier, bigger frames that cover more of your face. So the first pair that I have is, it's the OTL number two. Um, I think it stands for out to lunch. <laughs> I think that's what it stands for, but it's the OTL number two. This again was in a collaboration with Desi, I believe, but that is what they look like. They are just like a 
It goes from black to a tortoise shell, so I love this pair because it's very versatile. I can wear it with my black stuff, I can wear it with my brown stuff, so I love that about this. And it's just, again, an easy pair just to throw on and it looks good. I wear this when I'm not wearing makeup as well and I just, I love it. So that is what these look like on. They're like straight across on the top, so your eyebrows really do like stand out in these. And then it has a really fun gold detailing on this side as well. I love these. It's a great go-to option if you just need a very versatile pair of sunglasses. This is a newer addition to my collection. These are the key after party glasses. I saw someone wearing these on Instagram and I was like, I need those. Like, I love that. This, I call this like my mom sunglasses. Like I just feel like this is a perfect pair. Again, just to put in your purse and just grab them, put them on and they're just gonna look good every single time. They're an all black frame, black lens. The lens, is it mirrored? No, the <laughs> lens is not mirrored, but it's all black. It does have a little bit of gold detailing on this side as well. I just think these look so chic, and I just feel like a mom would wear these. So <laughs> I call them my mom glasses, but I love this pair as well. It does have like a slight little cat eye, but nothing crazy. Um, and then I'll give you a little side shot. But I love these. This is another like safe option. <laughs> The next pair that I have is the After Hours frame, and it, this is a tortoise shell again. It has the brown lens, and I love this pair. I got it in another color as well because I love it just as much, but this is another really great pair. I honestly love all of my sunglasses, so I'm sorry if I sound repetitive. They're just, they, I truly do wear all of these, so... <laughs> I love them all, um, but this is another really great pair. Very safe. It's not. It's going to be a frame that can fit a lot of different face shapes, um, and it's going to look good on a lot of different people. And again, it's just the tortoise. And then I also got them in the matte black with the black lens. This is also a newer addition. I just like the all matte. I really like the matte black too. Like that just melts my heart. Like I just I love them good black on black. So. This is another great pair. Okay, now we're getting into like my very bougie, very big framed sunglasses. So these aren't gonna be for everybody, but I personally love them. I'm trying to take the tag off of one of them because I haven't worn these yet. They're very, very new to my collection. And just a little tip too, I recommend always waiting until the BOGO sale because Really and truly, you get the best bang for your buck during the sale because you get a whole pair for free. So, I mean, you might as well. That's what I've always done. That's how my collection has grown to be what it is. <laughs> but this is the Style Nightfall. I love this. Again, it's the straight across at the top. It is a tortoise shell frame, um, but it does have a black lens. These are very big. They do cover... A lot of your face but I love this style as well I just think it's perfect for just a like I don't want to talk to anybody <laughs> I just feel like that's the mood like I don't want to talk to anybody please don't talk to me leave me alone kind of a frame and then this pair I actually wore down in Mexico it's the same style nightfall but it has a pink lens like a pink gradient lens kind of looks like a sunrise it's like the pink and then it fades into like a yellow with a tortoise shell frame as well and that is what these look like they are reflective which i love and i think they also have a blue one as well where it's like dark blue to light blue very very pretty okay so this What's up? <laughs> okay so funny enough <laughs> this is the pair brand does not like like at all he makes fun of me every time i wear this frame <laughs> Because it's just, he calls them like my space frames because they just are that like big, out there, obnoxious. This is the style Cafe Racer. They look like this. Very chunky in like the nose area. Matte black, cross, or very flat across the top. And then they're just all matte black. So I will try these on as well. But these are definitely not for the faint of heart. Like these are large in charge <laughs> kind of pinches your nose a little bit if you have like a, a short nose but yeah i like this style as well this is definitely one of those that i'm just 
I feel bad and bougie in, so love this as an option. Be careful though with these if you have like a nose ring because and a short nose because they do kind of pinch if you want to wear them down lower, so just a heads up. And then last but not least, this pair I reach for over the previous pair that I just showed you if I'm going for more of like a bigger style. This is the style Hindsight and it looks like this. It kind of looks like a mirrored lens, but it's not. Um, very, very like square looking. Again, it's matte black with the black lens. But I do reach for these over the other pair just because I feel like they're... they At first, they don't really pinch my nose at all, but it also gives me like the same vibes and like the same effect as the Cafe Racer ones. So I love this one as well, and I do reach for this one more often. But that is this pair in the side view. And that is it. That is all of the sunglasses I have from Key. I love all of them, like I've been saying this whole time. And I definitely think you should take advantage of the sale if you've had your eyes on these for a while. I know I first saw them on Instagram, and ever since I bought my first pairs, I have been hooked. Like, I cannot get enough of these. I don't think there's actually been a pair that I really, really, like, don't like. So... Yeah, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, again, please give it a thumbs up and tell me down below in the comments what your favorite pair is or if you have a pair that you want to pick up during the sale, let me know. I would love to chit-chat with you guys and maybe some of your favorites are some of my favorites too. So anyways, thank you guys for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye.